because uh, how many people saw the Iron Man on TV? Okay, you saw the Iron Man on TV, so this guy winning. And there's a couple of quotes in there from Chris McCormick uh, during the show where he said some things about, you know, Craig's weakness is the bike, everybody knows that, and uh, so we've got to exploit that because he's a great runner, so we're just going to drop him on the bike and he'll never be a factor again. So, you haven't seen the show, correct? No, he has not seen the show. So what, respond a little bit to uh, the, the battle between you and my man, uh, Chris McCormick. Well, as you know, Bob, talk is cheap. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> how, how did Chris go in Kona? I th he, he did okay, he finished fourth. He had right? a great race, he had a great race. But, um, you know, I don't, I don't get caught up. I've known Chris for 15 years and... Um, I think when he says things, he's trying to convince himself as much as everybody else. And, uh, you know, I, I was quietly confident, you know, in 08, which I think, I'm, I'm sure Chris would agree, I think 08 was a tough year in terms of the wind on the bike. And, um, you know, I held my own there. And, I mean, I think my resume speaks for itself. I've, I've won LA, Chicago, Lifetime Fitness, Clearwater. Um, I don't think you, you know, you're com competitive in any big international race if you have any weaknesses. And, uh, Chris might have perceived that as a weakness, and uh, I'm sure he tried to exploit it, but um, at the end of the day, I, you know, I had a great race, and I, I was more than happy, and I mean, I think he had a great race. I think, you know, I think he overachieved for what, what I, I, I thought he'd finished, you know, somewhere from 6th to 10th. I was looking more at guys like Liedo and um, Rasmus Henning, Andreas Rayler, uh, you know, a lot of the Europeans are coming right. now, so... Um, you know, you, you do run the slide rule over your opposition, but as far as what people say, it, it doesn't really impact on my race at all. Well, what's your record against, uh, Chris? Well, I'm glad you asked, but um, <laughs> dating back to about 03, it's 9 to 1 in my favour. There we go. Okay. Just, just curious. I figured so maybe you might know that. That's not a bad record. <laughs> Anyone's entitled to a bad day. 